Sweep legs, there. he survived the storm. Yeah, it was pretty crazy. My daughter's school lost power for like an hour and a half. Um, hey, I'm not trying to one-up you, okay? I promise. We ha like, <laughs> do you know of Abbotsford in BC? Uh, kind of, not really. Okay, they have... grown up since then, so I'd probably say it's probably not far off from 200,000 people now. Um, they, for the most part, still don't have power. The whole town. Oh, wow. Like, I don't know yeah. if some substance uh, damaged, but yeah, they just... Uh, I, someone went and shared it on Facebook, and it was like a picture, and it had um, the red dots for all the different damages that are still causing no power, and it was just covered in them. I'm like, this, I was just like, oh... <laughs> So. Yeah, that that is no fun for sure. We, uh, um, I actually drove by the, um, the the. It's not a substation. You know those those green, um, boxes that they put like junctions uh, into for for when they kind of pull power up out of the ground. Because we have all underground power. Yeah, it's like a, uh, it's to, like the kind sub of substations or whatever. It, it's it's a junction yeah. point. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, someone had, uh, I'm not sure if they just weren't paying attention or what, but they had driven their car into it. Yeah. <laughs> and so I was like, oh, that's good. You know, that's that's what you want to see. That's what you want to see. Well, in but in Abbotsford, they had. Uh, wind mile, wind uh, speeds of uh, sixty-three miles per hour. That's impressive. Yeah, that was. I think Chilliwack was ranging somewhere in the high eighties, like eighty-seven kilometers an hour. What is that? Because eighty-seven kilometers an hour doesn't make sense to you. That's fifty-four miles an hour. So that's what they were. I, I know the rough. <laughs> you know the rough. The rough conversion. Yeah, but it helps a little bit. <laughs> if I say it in what your metric measurements are. So. Uh, that is true. So yeah, we were getting about true. fifty-four Sweet. mile an hour winds, and uh, they were getting in the sixties. There <laughs> is just I looked at that. I was kind of like, what does that do to a car that's trying to drive on the roads or the highway? It's like. Ugh. It blew oh up. man, they they were posting. The Seattle City Police was posting f pictures of, um, of like wind damage, basically. Yeah. And there was a bus, uh, similar to the one that that caught fire yesterday, but it had been pushed sideways across um, three lanes of traffic. Oh. Yeah. Just because it got hit by a, a a gust and just just decided it was gonna slide across three lanes of traffic. Well, it's you know when it, when you got that wide of a surface area of a sail. for it to hit, yeah, it's just like a big sail. You're just basically driving around with a big sail on you, and you know, yeah. especially when you're not moving. And when you're moving, it's a very different matter because your vehicle will actually, on some level, cut through. And you got a better yeah. chance, but if you're just literally stopped in traffic and a big gust of wind hit, there's literally you're you're in your worst case scenario there. There's there's not much. That's the last case scenario that those buses were really meant for. So <laughs> it was unreal. Yeah. I ended up being 12 minutes late for work yesterday. I called ahead, let them know. They've never like I don't even if I don't even call them, they don't fuss about it because I usually do. But like because I've sometimes I've come in, they said, well, why didn't you call? And I said my phone wasn't letting me so yeah because there's just too much there's too much uh um yeah they're, they're, people are using it too much yeah yeah no i know how that goes well on the positive side my settings in have here. held overnight but i just don't know if they're going to do it again 
And I also don't know, like, I was like, I was all confused. I turned my monitors on because everything else is usually on. My Xbox isn't. My Xbox is usually off. But my PC, I usually just let it stay on because I'm uploading to YouTube and yeah. all that. And uh, it was just like, let's turn that down. And uh, box the... Why? Did someone run away? Someone ran away! A dirty bastard. What in your... Um, targets you were supposed to kill? Yeah, well, so I was I opened up a strong box, and for the box to open, you have to kill everyone yeah. that pops out of it. And one of them and run away? One of the guys, yeah, just straight up ran like three rooms away. I was like, where are you going? Oh, of course, there's He's, nothing. He saw you killing everything. He said, I'm out. I, I didn't agree to this. I'm out. <laughs> Later. I'm Dunzies. Why? I, don't, I do not want to be here anymore. I, I've been, uh, I spent most of yesterday getting my, uh... House ready? Um, uh, my house, yeah. But also gearing up my guy on the, the auction house. Mm. Um, and so... It was, uh, it's coming together. Nice. Let's hope there aren't lasting effects. Take them out, please. I like where he's at. I've got my, uh -oh. Did you get something for your resilience? You get yourself uh, not yet. Uh, my health I, and my, my mana sustain, I've got taken care of. Um, cause I got a ring that gives me, um, mana on melee hit okay um and life on melee hit so as long as i'm attacking something it's almost impossible for me to die um it's just stuff like this where the boss is kind of like running away from me and not uh letting me hit him mm. that makes it those those types of fights are harder but Nah, we're good. Though, the buttons on my controller are really pissing me off. We're making good progress. Because I can't. But taking energy readings are still oh, what? The there must be a oh, I just died. The Cabal hurt us, but the Taken could ruin the EDZ forever. Put an end now to I have it. to set up all my silly purities again. Hmm. This place is old. I'm trying to get some sword kills. I need sword kills and I need electrical kills and to get some ingredients. I'm glad you reclaimed it. Oh, boo. Give me. There we go. Got some flash of inspiration. Thank you. Okay. Now I gotta see his vengeance sword is done. Kills. Uh oh. What's going on? Oh, really? Why, why are you doing that? Alright. Hold on. I'll be right back. I'm gonna get another cup of coffee.
know why I'm not saying it. Giving me taken better. I need sword kills. Interesting. Sweet. Stop giving me taken better. I don't need taken better. I got enough taken better. Butter, butter. Who needs the butter? I don't want butter. I want margarine. More healthy. Yeah. We carry both. <laughs> Well, on some level, we carry the butter too because it's just better for baking. But for sure. For sure. Alright, do I need to sell anything else? Bacon energy is spiking. <laughs> this is it. I don't need more digging butter! Getting like 10 of them in a strike alone. Pet you need the butter! Pet my chicken. Pet it! Pet it! Kill the guy in charge and his big Eat scary the blood. butter. The scouts I sent... That, I'm, I was so happy when my when my in-laws cat left. Um, Why do your cat calm down then? Because... Well, my cat calmed down, yeah, but they were they were actually getting along okay. It was more that I could actually leave butter out on the countertop again. Oh, she was without... all over the butter? Oh my god, he... It, it was a boy, and he... He would just sit there and just... Like, lick the butter. And <laughs> he wouldn't stop until you took the butter away. <laughs> it was disgusting. I mean, he would... If you put if you put a whole stick of butter out, he would eat the, the whole, whole stick of oh. butter. And then, and then just hork it all up. Oh yeah, that's what I was gonna say. I was like, gonna eat it to the point where he's gonna puke it right out. Oh. oh yeah. He he is a habitual like binge and purge. <laughs> Awful. If you've ever cleaned up regurgitated butter, no. One of the finer points. <laughs> Uh, my wife, my wife uh, I made her a milkshake one time. I can't remember if she was pregnant or not. And it was just one of those, I think maybe she might have been pregnant or something. It was just one of those things where it's like, she that's what she wanted. But she was also had like such horrible morning sickness that she couldn't keep anything. And uh, Oh yeah, that's awful. And what was it? She, uh, she had the milkshake and she said, I know what it's like to be one of those soft serve machines. Like, it's just, it's the worst thing. It's like brain freeze, but in reverse. And it's like, it doesn't yeah. taste the same. It's not right. And, it, and she just said it was, it just, it was this huge, thick, frothy thing that was just, and she's like, that was just the gross, grossest thing. It took her a long time to be open and okay with uh, ha having the, uh, a soft serve, or to have uh, ice cream again. Oh, I can imagine. She still I is not uh, interested in... Uh, what was it? She's still not interested in... Um, Subway. She still doesn't like Subway. And that was like oh. well, five, six years ago. She puked up it up once because... 
Uh, we were driving in the camper of my dad's truck and uh, she doesn't do well. She got morning, she got, not morning sickness, she just got um, uh, road sick and <laughs> I quickly like texted her and I said, you bop, <coughs> and she quickly got out and she puked it off on the side of the road, but it took years and because she's still not a huge subway fan. She's, she'll have it now, but there was a long time where she just outright said, no, just find a Tim Hortons, you can drop me off, you can go have your subway there, but I'm not, she's like, I don't even want to go in their building. <laughs> not that subway's bad, it was just, she just totally linked yeah, that. Yeah, she's got that negative. That negative. That, that negative yeah, connotation. And, with and for it. her, it doesn't matter how long she had of good, that one bad experience is enough to throw her off of it for a good long while. That's a bummer. Subway, I mean, I don't mind Subway, but it's not it's not great food. I'd sooner have Subway than McDonald's. Oh, for sure. But but I don't consider McDonald's even good food. No. It's it's like barely mediocre. It's where you go to have cheap food have for your play kids. Places. That's that's we how go I to view Chick -fil -A. McDonald's. Yeah, we, we don't have Chick Fil A. My kids there. prefer Chick Fil A. I know. We just got Chick Fil A here in the Pacific Northwest, uh, in in Washington. <laughs> they, for the longest time, they were saying that they couldn't put them up here because they couldn't source the the chicken that they needed uh, to make all their sandwiches and such. Because they need a very specific chicken. Well, no, it's just the the quality that they would source isn't there oh uh they they couldn't they couldn't get the quantity of quality chicken that they wanted for their stores okay do they actually so, do they actually are dealing in quality chicken i uh, i mean that's what they said <laughs> i don't know that i believe them i mean their their chicken is better than like any of the other fast food chicken you can get so in that regard sure I don't mind um I'm okay with the what was it um which one was it that uh wasn't bad a McDonald's chicken McDonald's chicken at least up here is not bad but our chicken's also different than yours because ours is quoted so if you buy chicken it's all quota chicken so they're all grown and managed in the same way all the farms have very specific guidelines they have to follow not a it would be nice for yeah. them to they have to follow yeah yeah <laughs> it would be nice if you'd follow these regulations that that tends to work well right yeah <laughs> I've, I've never heard of a business voluntarily put... Well, that's not true. That's not true. There have been some companies that have voluntarily gone above and beyond the stated regulation, but not many. No. And where is this stupid door? I guess that's the one thing I like about Path of Exile over, like, de like a Destiny style game is that is a prison cell. their stuff is always, is the key. um, their layouts always change. It's never the same. So even if you go back and run the same area over and over again, it's never the same layout, mm. which could be frustrating, I suppose. But I don't know. I I kind of like it in that I don't have to worry about um, ever getting bored as to where things are. It's not ever going to be the same. Yeah. So. Alright, that's a dead end. There it is. I found the door. You found the door. I found the door. Yay! Finally. I'm in Act Ten, and so I'm trying to. 
Man, you can trying to finish off that stuff now. Well, so this has taken me a week um, to get this character uh, to through Act Ten and hit level seventy. And I mean, I've seen. I mean, there are some guys that admittedly play a lot more than I do, but they can take a character through the entire, like all 10 acts and get into the end game stuff in five to six hours. I'm like, holy gobbers, that is, that is way too goddamn fast. <laughs> like even with, I, I, that has to be, that can't be in, um, well, maybe it is. I don't know. Like, doing... Because I spend so much time, um, like, getting my my gems set up and and all of that. And I think the guys that, that, that get through the story in, in, like, five to six hours, these are guys that are just doing... Um, they just basically run as fast as they can. Mm-hmm. Um, <clears throat> and then, um, and then worry about getting all their gems set up afterwards, not doing it as they're going. What do you mean by so, gems? Uh, your skill gems. So, so the, the gems that give you, um, like all of your abilities. Um. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So the ones that you put in your armor? Yep. Um, they they just get their primary setup, um, and then they run with that all the way through the end, basically, and gearing up as they get it. And they're just good enough at the game to... Um, uh, and then the, when they get to the end game, then they start really gearing up because there's no, I mean, leveling gear is nice, but it's not really necessary for most of the stuff. Just getting stuff for the bosses, I think, is the the biggest uh, the he biggest piece. Stash. The note said this was the place he hid it. We find the stash. We find the parts we need to repair the Ace of Spades. And in the main story, it doesn't really matter if you die or not. Mm. It just when you get into the end game and you only have six tries at a map before that map disappears. Got to hide out. Destiny went and added uh, Cade's Last Will and Testament to the actual storyline, so you can actually go and run it as a daily. Oh, really? Yeah. Ugh. I don't know how I feel about this, because it's awful. a little bit annoying. Well, it's a more annoying than well, anything a... else, because it's I gotta go to find these stupid things to scan. And I was looking forward to not well, having to do this long... again. Oh. oh, it's just the final, like, well, his actual so... last will. He's got a whole bunch of boxes and I can't remember where they were so now I'm searching for them again. Yeah. Yeah. I don't like these games. On, let me... Ooh, crafting recipe. Yeah. There. Give me that crafting recipe. Ooh, chaos damage. Nice. Got it. Oh, that's right, there's a trial in this area. Ooh! Exotic. 
Nice. One before. Oh, dart traps. Son of a... Oh, that's right! I can't ever be slowed to low base speed! Oh, god, that's so amazing! What? You, what? Oh, my character has a, a skill that even if I get hit by, like, slow darts, I can't ever be slowed below base speed. Which makes going through dart traps like that so much nicer. Because they slow you down so much. <laughs> it is ridiculous. <laughs> Alright. If you're listening to this, kill me. But I bet I took a big chunk of your ugly husk with me. Guess Andal Brask wasn't enough for you, huh? You wanted another Hunter Vanguard for your sick collection? I got my share of regrets, sure. But not putting a bullet in you has got a ring in the top three. Hold this on before a better guardian than me. Alright, email. I just wish I could be there to see it. We're having pizza for dinner. Ooh. And so... We well, do, um... Order in. No, nah, we'll do Papa, uh, Papa Murphy's. Or, yeah, Papa Murphy's. The, uh, the Take and Bake. Yep. Ooh, sweet! I don't think we have a Papa Murphy's up here. We got Papa John's. I think they do the same thing. You can yeah. take it home and you can make it, or they can uh, cook it for you. Oh, really? They'll, they'll make it and you can take it without it being cooked? I believe so. Nice. All right, where is my code? Why? Why is it not loading? Give me my sharp flavor already. This isn't fun. Out. Uh, right. Um. All my swords are voiding it up. What do you need? Arc. I need arc. Well. And I need sword kills for some of my last ingredients. Well, I've I've basically made all of my cookies. I just need to make one more, and then I've really click on those triumphs and get off. But it's not giving me my sword uh, recognitions. I don't know how many I have to kill, or if I have to kill a certain size to. Uh, Get the thing. Ooh, ninety two max life. Heck yeah. Spell Caspi. Mm. I'd sell. I got a new emblem. I made Shax proud. Mmm. Making the old man proud, huh? And then I also got a triumph for uh, doing a complete round of Gambit, like I said yesterday, and I didn't uh, die once, so that gave me a... Oh, that happened yesterday? Uh... Oh, I didn't think that was... I thought that happened previously. Actually, that might have been the previous time. Oh, I can't remember. Getting too old. Get too old for this garbage. Ooh, look at that. These are not even worth anything, You're just clicking. Oh, 
Oh, I'm not getting fortify, that's right. Oh, I need fortify. Um... That you can shoot down at me and I can't shoot up. At Shooting, let my recovery kick in. Dang it. I'm gonna die because of the big stash is nearby. I know it's up there. I'm trying to get to it. Increase attack speed, accuracy, eh, critical strike. Strike. Lightning resistance. Hmm. Jeez, that was a point. Seven percent increase max life. Oh, there we go. That's the one. Well, I will say, at least this time around, for looking for these chests, they made them uh, glow. So for the most part, they're easy to find. Oh, that's nice. Like, I can see there's one straight ahead. I thought there was. So, you're welcome. Hi guys. Bring it on. All right. Now I just have to figure out how to get fortify. What do I know? I'm dead. Heat slam. That's how I do it. Petra, if you're listening to this, you killed me. Maybe the Sobs, in all their mysterious wisdom, decided they were sick of me? If the Queen ordered the hit, I, oh, there you are. I understand. You're a real glutton for chivalry. But if it was Aldrin, I'm pissed. Just thinking about that peacock gives me a headache. But I'm betting all right. that it was not a case of your fate like like collateral damage. Cause you're a real dude. Seriously, it's annoying. But good deeds never go unpunished when you're around. Eleven twenty. Mm. All right. Well. Well. I think I'm gonna have to sign off All right. and finish cleaning my house before everybody comes home. Doesn't look like you just played video games all day. <sighs> yeah, I really want to. <laughs> I really want to. God, what that did, would be so nice, wouldn't it? What did uh, your employers do with uh, the legalization of pot in Washington? I wouldn't want people knowing what I did either. Nothing. They don't give a shit. Tell anyone about the crib or about the uh, <sighs> um, so there's my... no rules, regulations on like you could go smoke a joint and then you could come to work and they'd be fine with that, as long as they don't catch you, basically. Um, pretty much. Um, it's it's one of those. Um, don't ask, don't tell. Uh, yeah. Yep. 
my defense, if you're listening to this, you did kill me. I mean, if oh, they're on special. Like, yeah, it's model, as long as as long as you're not like stumble drunk. Um, that's all that matters. Some would call that I call it being a hunter. So here's your next hunter. Um. So. Um. Yeah, it's. You are now the owner of the colonel. We work in such a a weird business that I don't have to do drug tests at all. I don't have to do um, uh, any of any of that kind of stuff. Well, and with your guys' um, place, I imagine most of those people don't actually have much of an interest in that because they they have more they have better things to do with their money than to go buy pot. Well, I mean, I'm sure so I can almost guarantee. There are people in, um, in, at my office this month. Yeah. Guaranteed. Um, but I don't think they care. Um, uh, is the thing. So, I don't know. I, I haven't smoked in, in, Long enough. Almost like 15 years. Yeah, 13, 15 years. Because um, I just don't... I mean, I have no interest. Yeah. So. Well, it's funny. I was talking with one guy, and he, you know, I was talking to him, and I said, you know, like, what... You know what pot does to motivations, right? And he's already getting all defensive about it. He's like, well, I smoke pot. I'm like, that's fine. But you've got to make sure that you don't let the stuff take away from your life. And I said, there's too many people in the world that they can't handle that stuff. They can't have it in their life. Yeah. Yep. Yep. And, I, I mean, I know plenty of people that have... Um, that, that don't have motivational issues yeah. with... Um, when they smoke. Yeah. But it's That's not the regularity. Uh, look. Yeah. Keep your weapons sharp. Yeah, exactly. Um So, I don't know. I don't mind about what you for your successors Vanguard dare. I don't mind people that do. This game will kill as long as like you say as long as they're as long as they're doing it responsibly, that's fine. I really don't care. But my concern is that there's just too many people that aren't going to be able to do it responsibly, and then it's going to put someone's life in danger. Yeah, that would be... That to me is not... That would be unfortunate. Yeah. Uh, now it's getting to be a regularity of, hey, uh, another kid has brought some of mommy and daddy's edible gummies to school. Because they left it out. Really? Yep. It's happening almost monthly now, I think. Wow. Well, and, the, and you know, you, you meet so many people that they like the stuff, and they're like, oh, no parent's going to do that. You know how expensive that stuff is? You're going to keep that stuff away from your kids. And I'm like, well, it's happened three times this last around Halloween because the kids wanted to bring some candies to share time for Halloween with their kids. And... And then people are just kind of like, well, that's parents being stupid. It's like, well, but these statements aren't just for you. They are for everyone. They're trying to get people to know that they need to properly hide this stuff. Put it in a lockbox. Like, this is not stuff that they should have access to, period. Yeah. Agreed. Agreed. Sorry, I'm, I'm making a pizza. Ooh, what are we having? Uh, it's called the Cowboy. Um, it's got pepperoni, I Italian sausage, mushrooms, olives. Um, uh, what else it has on it? Um, an herb and cheese blend. Ooh. Yes. It's quite tasty. So you're ordering through their website? You're clicking that right now, or...? 
Yeah, yeah. Clicking through. I like their... I don't know why, but their website, I think is for... They have it optimized for um, mobile. Oh, okay. And it just makes everything super huge. Oh, the doing through your uh, computer, just uh, proportions are all off? Yeah. 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 It is. It makes it... Uh, it just makes it really big. Yeah. I probably told you. I always gotta have the last word. Jump across. Possibility. My is right, to left. This one's the easiest uh, to make. So long as we're being honest. Sauce, regular I sauce. Tell if you really like me that much. But, uh, toppings. Well, she it, likes it, the it, bacon it, and black olives. In fact, and then yeah, I'll say it. Don't even mind. Right half. We got we threw down no sauce. No one can blame me for losing. And I know you'd be in the right. So black olives, oh, extra black olives. A, a good friend. And better than a guy like me could hope for anyway. So uh, yeah. Right. Thanks. I gotta change that too. For everything. This one's for the strong silent. Type. Right. You. Congratulations, buddy. So and sauce. Always knew you'd outdo me something. Bacon and extra. And if that means you had to do me in too. And this side there is no sauce. So extra black to you so. anyway. Take care of the ace of spades, will you? And I'm not just talking about the maintenance. Woohoo! Alright. Take care of Ace. Then use it well. Oh hey, and two minutes. if you found any of those papers Later. in my earlier uh, deployments? Early. Don't want people poking through the lives of Kate Zero to five. So just put it all behind you, okay? Every story has an end. This is mine. So are you are you streaming or are you still working on your settings? Uh, I'm streaming, but it's doing the same things that I was telling you of. It's like the the upload rate is just all over the place right now. Ew. Yeah. I'm right now dropping twenty one. Per I've dropped twenty one percent of my frames. So oh, one in five Jesus. frames gets dropped. That is awful. Yeah, I don't know what to do to fix it. I need fiber in my neighborhood so bad. What, uh... Um... What... Um... Uh, uh, what resolution are you streaming at? Uh, 720. That's, that's, that should be just fine. Yep. It certainly should. Yeah, you should not. I shouldn't be struggling. No. No, you should not. Because when I started, yeah, it was fine. Weird. It was up at 2,000. Now it's down to 1,400. I just don't know if people are um, hopping online. It seems odd, though. What? That, like, it's not a... This is not a, like, high-frequency time to be... But it's Friday of the long To be weekend. online. Oh, that could be. Right? Yeah. Yeah.
one of the Twitter accounts I follow. Leaving f uh, work for the holidays, like, and it's uh, Mr. Bean uh, uh, sitting on uh, top of a convertible, and he's fingering all the cars while he's going by because he thinks it's a way of saying hello. It's from his uh, Mr. Bean movie. <laughs> Sounds about right. Sounds about. It's, it's Mr. Mr. Bean. Bean it, that's Mr. Bean in a nutshell. Pretty much. On the right track. You have to DM me that uh, pizza because that actually sounded really yummy. Yeah. Yeah, I, I'm. It's a. Uh, like I said, they call it the cowboy, and it's definitely one of my favorites. But if you don't have a Papa Murphy's, I guess you could always request it from somewhere else. I, I, all I need is the ingredients and I can go and request some to make that. True. True. Is she gonna text me back? Okay. Uh, made my... no thanks. Oh, I got sharp flavor! Yes! Finally! Try and store some up some sharp twenty four dollars off my order. How'd you do that? Love it. Uh, I got a fifty percent off coupon. Oh, nice. Yeah. How many pizzas did you order? Uh, three. Three pizzas, what would that usually cost us? 30 bucks? Up here? Mm, this uh, originally was 47. Okay. They're about 14 bucks a piece. Well, you also <clears> ordered <throat> some late. You ordered extra, so that's gonna. They use always charge for those. Well, I ordered a, 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 a stuffed pizza, which is 17. Uh, so. Get that stuffed that's crust. For me. Oh, it's not stuffed crust, it's a stuffed pizza. Okay, what's the difference? Thank you very much. The whole pizza is two layers. So it's two pizzas on top of one another? Yeah, basically. I don't know if we do that here. I think they might have tried it and it just didn't sell as much as they were wanting. I can understand that. I, I think they're somewhat popular at least I don't order them very often just because we don't um, usually have enough people to make a pizza that big worth it yeah um, because they I mean that's a lot of pizza yeah Our processor. I just need to connect it to the Vex network. You're near the well of echoes. Right. The confluxes there should work. Uh, so someone with a Twitter ha handle iFateBringer uh, tweeted out When you realize Colonel Kate Chicken will be all alone on Christmas, lie down, try not to cry, cry a lot. <laughs> Uh... 
Lots of people. It'll be Cade's chicken's first year without Cade for Christmas. Sounds about right. It's unfortunate though. Bloody chicken. Poor guy. Oh, see, Poor now, chicken. So I was going at 1,000 kilobytes per second on my upload. Now I'm up to 2,000. Now it fixed itself. And, it, and you're not dropping frames anymore? Uh, no, it seems to be holding. Yeah, so you just. You're right on that edge. Well, it, like on some level, like like last time when I was streaming, I was talking to you yesterday. Oh, see now, but now I've gone up. So I was at two thousand, and I wasn't dropping frames. I went up to twenty eight hundred, and I'm dropping. Oh no, I haven't dropped the frame yet. Okay. See the the like I was at two thousand, and it was green. Now I'm up at twenty six, twenty seven, and I keep going between the yellow, orange, and green. I wish those numbers made more sense. <laughs> numbers mean things, I promise. They kind of mean things sometimes. But not all the time. Not all sometimes. the time. Just when the government needs money from you. That's when they mean... That's when the numbers make sense. <laughs> That's when the numbers matter. Oh, was it? Uh, I it's. I would love to go to. Who was it? I C B C. I think it was our insurance guy, because he was just saying like, oh, you know, we'll we'll, you know, we'll we'll pay you when we can, or type of thing. And I was like, if is is that the company's policy? Is pay when you can? So I could get ten years of insurance, and I'll I'll pay you when I can. Like, can I buy my insurance that way? It's like, no, you pay when you have to. Like, these are agreements. This is business. This is transactions. You don't pay when you want to. That is crazy. That's kind of ridiculous. How much does your guys' insurance cost? Get me to the car flux and I'll plug in the process. Um, For your Tacoma, what does well, it your, Is your Tacoma or Tundra? I can't remember. I think it's a Tacoma. No, you have a four, uh, up on 50. No, it's a... Yeah. Um, and it's... <clears throat> um, what is it? Um... It is... I think it's like a grand every six months. Okay, that's about what we're paying. And that's for the two cars. That's for both? Yeah. Oh. Well, we're paying like 100% markup then from you almost. To ensure your truck but we, that's every, here, you're looking... That's every six months. So a year, it's it's two grand for the two cars. Yeah. For us to insure two vehicles, you're probably looking at close to 4,000. Wow. Yeah. That is That is more. And they're talking about that they have to raise our increase our uh, rates again. Oh really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, they keep running these that... overages because, and it's like they're just <laughs> they're being very bad business managers. It's it's ridiculous. At some point in time, like, and the people are starting to tell them like, look. Fix your side, not us. Like, you can't just keep charging us more money because you don't know how to do business. <laughs> and they said every every time the last... They have enough money to get through to October. October, and then usually November and December is when they start running the deficits. And they asked them, okay, well, where are your... Like, they've had audits done, and they've said... Uh, what was it? They said that they were about 300 million dollars in debt and I think the audit brought out and said that they were closer to like 900 million dollars in debt or something like they were way off on their on their accounting side like there's there's money missing that they're not accounting for 
Boo. So I'm really hoping that they're eventually going to come to an agreement and an understanding that there needs to be a competitor. Because this is just... this. We don't even have a competitor. We're not even allowed a competitor. We have one insurance company. Oh, really? Us. That's it. Bad news. It's a monopoly. Wow. That you can buy your extended insurance through someone, but that's your extended insurance. You have to buy your primary through them. The answer lies in the past. If you found the wow. That is that is some craziness. Yes. We go back to the moment that led to Panopti's run time forward and use that data to find its location in the present. Oh, that's good, Ikora. Osiris level good. You know, you're not the same Ikora I remember. You're better. Oh, I need... Yeah, okay. Now I really have to go. <laughs> now I'm actually going to go in. Not like that, but four time when I said I was going to go. Yeah. You know, I should really, <laughs> really do that. But I was, I was doing so good getting my stuff set up. <laughs> I was doing such a good job. Such a good job. I'm I'm starting to get my kind of end game kind of gearing up. Nice. And it's I ran out of um <laughs> ran out of money. <laughs> ran out of currency. So I need to um I need to go deal with that. What I really need to do is I need to start selling stuff. Selling stuff's good. Yeah, but the trading system in uh, Path of Exiles is so wonky that <clears throat> what do you it's mean? just, it's hard. Well, so you put it, you basically, you have to buy, you have to buy some currency with real money to get premium stash tabs. And then when you the do that, transformed Mercury into a garden um, world. It was a you have to. Until the Vex came. You basically the Vex, you set the premium tab up to be public, and then we call it, it the gets listed on like the auction house um, that everybody in the game no can see. But when you do that, no what happens is is that people just session. dump garbage into their premium tabs, and so people have to sort through all of all of the garbage to find what they want and so if you don't have what people are specifically looking for it it makes it hard to uh, to find that too is a sign it, it makes it hard for other people to find your stuff it's not like you can advertise that you have stuff available that's the that's the hard part about it so me bitching and complaining. So, yep. Alrighty. Well, enjoy Destiny, and yeah, I'm doing I my last will... daily, and then I think I'm heading off too. But I'm actually heading off. Sweet. <laughs> yeah, I am too. Are I'm you going to be I'm on leaving. tonight? No, my parents are are flying in this afternoon, so probably going to be. Um, eating pizza, drinking, and chatting with them. Tonight. Cool. Have fun. Yeah, good times. Well, I will talk to you later. Talk to you later. See you. There is a Vex gateway near your location. Osiris spent years studying it. He was convinced it was the door to the infinite forest. If it is still possible to find Osiris, we need to open that door. Ikora Ray, Osiris's greatest student. Brother Vance, <laughs> Osiris's greatest fan.
Ruby, that's enough. Cyrus. Running! Please make it hit. Whew. Excuse me. No, I'm really not interested in the XP. You guys aren't even hitting me. Okay, I gotta literally do this. I'm gonna make that one cookie. Can't get through. Find Zer, well, hand Cyrus him his, hand the other one off. Maybe she could help. Osiris, preserve us. You have his ghost, Sigira? Please, please bring her to me. Cookie. Bringing it. Since the vault of glass. Bye bye. Their descendants, they should be weak, not strong. Their deck should be improving themselves. Excuse me. I 
you just open the door, please? Thank you. Oh, open the door. It's a big boo, big boy. Hey, take out the module. Done. Mechs from different timelines are converging on Mercury. That's bad. It's we took care of him. Hey, thank you. I don't know what I would have done if Osiris hadn't sent you to me. The followers of Osiris can help you revive his ghost. We have a hidden temple on Earth. Take Sagira to these coordinates. I will notify. I don't need them. I already did this. Now that the lighthouse is safe, we can prepare for Osiris's return. Yay! All don't care. The lost prophecies are coming to pass. I'm finally going to meet Osiris. That's nice. Good for you. We're getting there. You don't. That's actually power powerful. That's not really powerful anymore. This I guess that's the only thing I really left to uh, need an upgrade for. E. What's that Archer's Temples do? Uh, draw time decreases after each precision hit. Let's, um, where is Zer? Let's go and I have one cookie made. Oh, that was Zer's. That's right. Haha. Or a ray. Fail safe. And really, as I was hoping, what's the final recipe? Vanilla blue. Uh. Ball oil. Ball oil. Sharp flavor. Oh, I got two sharp flavors. I mean, master work it. Done. Hey, don't care. Okay, let's go to fail safe. And while fail safe.
Day to play. The birds are a chirping, snowmen are a singing. It's a gorgeous day to play. Oh, yes, the day it is full of life. I'm finally free to do what I like. It's a gorgeous day to play. Inside. Granted, these come with possible new. So we'll go there, and then I think we go to the tower because there's actually at the tower. Let's speak. No, uh, cores yet. Uh, so, Ikora Ray. They'll say if we're going to right There's now. One. Zer. And then Lord Shax. Then it's done. They've all gotten their cookies as well then. We need three more of those. And... There we go. Ooh. Damn, this is kind of a good shoddy, though. Rip. Come on. I need it. Oh, and it gave me two. Let's go. All right. 39, 35. These are going in here. That's some pieces of the boar randomly. All right, let's dismantle more. So, uh, hindsight, what are you, like? What are your plans for printing? Like, do you have things that you're like looking forward Retreat. to print, or? Oh, dawning is done. So I can't. I like I the oh, oh I just want to make destiny guns. Doesn't work. Doesn't fly for me. Oh, that that makes sense. That makes sense. Well, thank you. No oh, daily today, sense. for some reason. Dailies aren't dailies. Hmm. Hello. For the thing. Yeah, Let's you go. work up to the destiny guns. You gotta print the little. I feel like you have to print the little ship. Like that's your first print. Be careful, Captain. Okay, will do. Thank you, Mom. <sighs> The venture, yeah. You gotta do it. All right. Uh, bring me my okay. Here. Yeah, and we went through a lot of those things. We only have 74 now. Give me the things, please. There's the two. All right, so we needed to do these boots also. Uh -huh. No home bar is complete. No home bar is complete without having double old-fashioned glasses. So, great option. Half of your Christmas gifts this year are printed. That's awesome, Don't dude. Don't look like anything special. Okay. Get this gambit stuff out of the way, shall we? Oh, you can't get the chamber right? Rip. Can you, like, reuse the parts or nah? <laughs> uh, we said we had stuff in the Ghostmaster. Alright, who needs a. 
Uh, Petra. Spider. The model is I have a solid, can't pull the trigger, but printing with uh, sports is being difficult. I don't really know what that means, but. So I said Petra. Uh, you've Spider. gotten yours. You haven't gotten yours. We'll do those two and then we'll figure out if we the can get the bounty. Will you answer? Zuri is in the tower. You did not get short. Uh, he is in the tower over Yay. by Dead Orbit, um, on the the stairs, kind of in the back of the hangar. I got the sparrow. You hit that exclamation looks so point ugly. Zur, There's a clip from Carol cool. Lee. It is what it is. Um, and you can just watch that, and she'll show you how to get there. But he is in the tower. And she gets one. No, he was on IO last week. Anything you need. Last week he was on IO. You go. Ah, no problem, dude. Thanks, man. See if we can pick up some more bounties. Yeah, well, him. he definitely was there though, like like it's a couple up. weeks ago. Good I don't idea. know if it was two all or not, right, but right, he right. definitely was there. Let's see what you got. Recently. Scorn approaching. Of course it's scorn. Oh, you think we'd have run out of scorn by now? How are they breeding? I was gonna be on the road by now. Just saying. I think I'm just gonna buy myself lunch. Oh. Let's hunt some hostile sister. Let's go. Time. To the bank. Okay. Gotta go the all island. the way to the other Man, end. Last night it was super late and I was just like so frustrated with Gambit. It just was not going well. Uh no. Are they are those a year Zur can only give you year one stuff. I don't play on the Warlock too often, so I'm not familiar with those boots. So it depends on when those exotics came out. Hey. Oh, that guy just like teleport. Fine. Oh man, I didn't want to collect that. Damn it. Hostiles at the guard. Was it exactly two weeks ago? Nah, it's good, dude. Good. I guess it is. Uh, yeah, he gave them to me because I already have all of them. Uh, so once you, once you like uh, actually um, forge them all or whatever they call it, there's over here. Um, then you can. But upgrading my spare. Very right here. He's going to do that, but whatever. I have a cookie to give you. He's fine. Since it doesn't look like the other team's doing much. There you go. Half pint taken, headed to the other side. Portals okay, up. Yeah, yeah most of the really cool stuff is is Forsaken, and he won't be. Getting he, I already have the Gemini for Jester. A while. Uh, Unfortunately. I don't know if I have the Apophos Veil. Aeon Shay. What does that do? Uh, grants energy to nearby. Yeah, I have that one. Apophos Veil, I don't know if I have that one. Okay, guys. We're gonna wrap it up. The nine oh, how did I miss that? I know. That's what I... Have a good day. See you tonight, possibly. Oh. I'm going to try and have the energy for it. Okay?